John Williams had always considered himself a strong and dependable father, but one year ago, his world had been shattered. His beloved wife, Sarah, had succumbed to a sudden illness, leaving him and their six-year-old daughter, Emily, to navigate the treacherous waters of grief and loss. John's heart ached not only for the love he'd lost but also for the mother that Emily had lost so young. One evening, with the sun setting in a blaze of orange and red, John decided to take Emily to Hillsdale Park, a vast wilderness on the outskirts of their town. It was one of the few places that brought a glimmer of joy to their lives. They'd often come here with Sarah, making cherished memories amid the beauty of nature. As the sun dipped below the horizon, John and Emily strolled along the winding trails. The air was filled with the sounds of chirping birds and rustling leaves. It was a bittersweet moment, a mix of happiness at being in this special place and a painful reminder of the void left by Sarah's absence. Emily, always full of energy, darted ahead to chase a brilliant butterfly. John watched her, a smile on his face, momentarily forgetting the sorrow that had enveloped their lives. But when he reached the spot where she had been moments earlier, Emily was gone. Panic surged through him as he called out her name, but his voice trembled with fear and desperation. The world around him seemed to close in, the beauty of the park now transformed into an eerie and menacing forest. His cell phone was in his pocket, but it was a lifeless, black screen. Its battery had run out, leaving him with no way to call for help. The realization was paralyzing. John took a deep breath and tried to stay calm. He fumbled in his backpack for the small, yet bright emergency flashlight he'd brought just in case. Its beam cut through the darkening woods like a lifeline. Emily's disappearance had awakened a fear that had lurked within him ever since Sarah's passing, the fear of losing someone he loved. It wasn't just the fear of her being lost, it was the fear of someone else finding her and causing her harm, a fear that chilled him to the bone. Every rustle of leaves or snap of a twig sent shivers down his spine. He thought about the stories he'd heard of wild animals in the park, of strangers lurking in the shadows. The darkness seemed to whisper terrible secrets, and the silence was deafening. He waded through thorny underbrush, with branches clawing at his legs, and tripped over roots that seemed to conspire against him. The woods itself seemed to be against him, a malevolent force determined to keep Emily from him. As he continued his desperate search, the night deepened, and the woods grew even more sinister. John knew he needed to find Emily before darkness swallowed her whole. He refused to entertain the thought that he might be too late. With each step, John had to confront not only the dangers of the park but also the deep fears and insecurities that had haunted him since his wife's death. He had always considered himself a strong and dependable father, but he was now faced with the harsh reality of his limitations. The guilt for not keeping a closer eye on Emily gnawed at him, as did the fear of losing her like he had lost Sarah. The flashlight began to flicker, its batteries fading. The darkness closed in, and the cold grip of despair seemed to tighten around him. He couldn't let that happen, not when Emily's life might be hanging in the balance. Summoning every ounce of his determination, John pushed forward. He thought of Sarah and the strength she had possessed, and he drew from that memory. He remembered her smile, her wisdom, and her love, and he realized that he needed to become the father Emily needed him to be. The broken branches, thorns, and the relentless darkness became obstacles he had to overcome, not just physically but emotionally. He was no longer just a grieving husband but a devoted father, ready to face his worst fears to protect his daughter. And then, just when hope seemed all but lost, a faint voice reached his ears. Daddy? It was Emily's voice, fragile and scared, but alive. John followed her voice, the light of his flashlight illuminating her tear-streaked face. They were reunited in a heartfelt embrace, and John knew that he had found not only his daughter but also a renewed sense of purpose and strength within himself. As they made their way back through the dark and unforgiving woods, John held Emily's hand tightly. He knew that life would continue to present challenges and obstacles, but he was now resolved to face them head-on, with the newfound strength that had emerged from the depths of his own fears and insecurities. Together, they would heal and grow stronger, 
for they were a family that had weathered the darkest of storms and emerged into the light.